<laughs> Dill is Dill is is picking Rob. We're not seeing a shawl. I mean, hey, I pick my hero during button checks. The patented Dill button check, anyway. True. All right, now that they're parked. All right, so Rob versus Mega Man. It does look like we're going to be starting on Battlefield. The two robots of Smash. Who is more human? Mega Man. Yeah. Mega Man, like, very routinely disobeys Asimov's, like, code of robots or whatever. Yeah, which is weird because in the Mega Man X games, they said, like, oh, X is the first human-like robot. And it's like, what about all the other one. ones that... Whatever. Listen, Come. Mega Man tried to off a dude. He is definitely more human than any robot can be. <laughs> True. Because robots aren't even supposed to be allowed to do that when they're built. Asimov said so. But... This is no robot, so Mega Man is free to kill as much as he wants. <laughs> Same for Rob. I'm sure Rob's off some people, too. We're going to see a lot of, just a lot of carnage and violence coming into this game one. Have you seen the meme of, like, a real-life Rob just with knives attached to his hands? <laughs> no, that's funny. Rob has a body count. <laughs> I believe it. Anyway, let's get into it. This is a overall pretty decent matchup for Mega Man, because for all the uh, strengths that Rob has, Mega Man kind of just has clean answers for them. And by that, I mean he has lemons, which exist, and that's really all I need, for the most part. Yeah, definitely going to be helping Open9K out a lot in these sort of, like, mid-ranges where Dill likes to hang out to have uh, Gyro as, like, a burst option. And right there, the Leaf Shield actually just kind of repelling the Gyro as well. Yeah, they can come in handy. Leaf Shield is a pretty big commitment, though. Yeah. So, all right, we've got Dill off stage again. Oh, 9K. I love the use of Rush Boom. to catch the high recovery. Good stuff. A very good first stop. Yeah, great stuff. I mean, you know, Dill, especially, you know, playing a character like Rob, she gets the freedom to really recover from wherever she wants. Uh, but typically, a lot of characters just can't contest with Rob going high the way that Dill does. But I mean, Oh, 9K showing off already that they're able to cover that. Now we're seeing them play with a lead and getting some great percentage out of it. Indeed so. Looking to set up for a hard knuckle, maybe. Nope. Dill is, Dill is patient. Dill has thankfully been implementing more just doing the stall into grabbing the ledge instead of always coming back up onto the stage and throwing something at the opponent, mm -hmm. which is good, because I've seen Dill get into trouble way more times than she'd probably like to admit doing that. Where she's like, they'll never see me coming with the double jump back onto the stage after stalling for 10 whole seconds. And then they do. Surely no one would ever expect Rob to throw a gyro. Rob would never. Or forwarder. Either or. Right, now, seeing Obanon K looking to potentially close out the second stock while Dill is still trying to find the first one. Air dodge, gonna be oh. able to make it back. Oh. Not able to find the grab though. That's a good advantage for Mega Man on the stage. He can up tilt and be a little bit safer by landing on those platforms. All right, Leaf Shield not gonna help you against those the giant laser. Look at this, the super but. fighting robot living at 230. Never up, up, living right. at 232. Finally. New high score, ladies and gentlemen. Now Over 9K gets to play without the, the fear of death. So well. The well, fear of death when you're fighting Rob, <laughs> zero is kill percent. Well, yeah. The fear of, like, raw death. Yeah, raw death. <laughs> that, whole com that whole gyro combo is uh, one hit. Even so, Dill's done a good job hanging on to her stock for... Jesus Christ. Dill's done a good job hanging on to her stock for this, uh, this leg of the game, which is good. She really needed, it, needed to do that. I got some percent on the board before she uh, went down. Now this back air can be doing it. Now coming oh. a little bit to the uh, arm rotor again, but not not too much coming out of it for O9K. Going to be able to just keep poking with these lemons. They're just doing so much for O9K in this matchup. Oh my god, that was good shield pressure right there. Also, I just thought of this, but Mega Man doesn't really have to worry about down airs at ledge from Rob because, you know, Rush Coil is right there to save him. Mm -hmm. That's a good dog right there. <laughs> Man's best friend. Ooh. Robot's best friend. Mega Man's best friend. Mega Man's best friend. Damn, Mega Man doesn't have any friends. <laughs> and there we go, a spot dodge up smash will clinch it, but just barely. If that didn't kill, that would have been a huge menace in swinging over the NK's favor, that's for sure. Absolutely. 
Yeah, 72% on Dill right now. Certainly not out of the realm of possibility. possibility. Like you were saying before, you know, Rob can just do so much damage out of nowhere. It can just kill you if, if she wants. Is that it? No way. No, okay. Yeah, Mega, Man, Mega Man Heavy. The robot is alive, gets down air, but no such luck. I'm surprised Dill didn't go for a side beater. Does over 9k have match? He does not have a match. That's going to be important information for Dill for the rest of the set. He can't mash out at 95. That's fatal, actually. Mm -hmm. All right, returning to neutral. 9K trying to find some space <laughs> using these lemons. Whoa! Oh, oh, the up air? No up air. Yeah, very scary position for Open IK just on that platform there. I was surprised that Dill didn't try to poke or threaten at all. Oh, oh that was kind of cool. Oh my god! Wow. Very good stuff coming out from Open IK. Some great movement coming out there at the end. That was, that was nuts. Great game. Absolutely. A handsome game indeed. I cannot believe Ova9K lived to 232 against Rob. Yeah, that was great. But Dill did a great job bringing it back, too. Mm -hmm. Living to obscene percents for all of our stocks, which is what you need when you're fighting anyone, really, as Rob. Because for all the advantages Rob has, they do have the issue of, oh, every single kill confirm you've got in the book, it works on Rob. Yeah. <laughs> it might not work on a few subsets of characters. Rob's not in the, any of those subsets. Rob is in the, yes, it works here. But either way, that was a most, most bracing first game. Absolutely. Very enjoyable. All right, so Open on K's bands were TNC and Smashville. Definitely great bands. And let's see what our game two is going to be. It is, we are going right back to Battlefield. Right back to Battlefield. It's a good stage for both of them. Absolutely, Rob gets you know so much pressure on the platform, kind of like we saw near the end of game two. Dill didn't really like capitalize on it, but I mean, you know, Rob is so scary when you're above him. Indeed. Oh, is that a kill? No kills. Up tilt gets the up tilt. Yep, just waiting just a little bit to make Open 9K just that much more scared. Oh, I like that setup to pick up this metal blade real fast. You saw that? Yeah. Yeah. Miss input metal blade there over 9k sent it backwards and down. I don't know if that was intentional. Over 9k trying to set up some platform pressure of their own. I respect the attempted uh Oh! Yo, over 9k is actually using these committal like side air dodges in really creative ways, I gotta say. He used it to pick up the uh metal blade going up the rush call, he used it for wavelength, he used it to just bounce on rush twice. Yeah, Open K's movement has been really good, but I mean, don't let that distract you from the fact that Dill is finding these kills. Definitely setting a different tone from game one. Uh, Only 60% on the board so far. You always got to be careful if you're going to use movement like that, because if you're using a lot of movement, you know that means there's more of you all over the place. Yeah, especially if you're committing to that movement, then Dill's going to have the answers, especially with a character like Rob. Can just cover pretty much everywhere. This this is not a character with many blind spots. Oh my Ooh, God! Wake up! Get up. off me! Wake up, wake up, Shoryu! Then this isn't Street Fighter. Is still dead? No. Ooh, a little bit middle there on that hard knuckle. I'm gonna find Oba 9K a punish, and now potentially a reversal. Another. Oh, uh, get hit middle. by that. The Robo B. Optic blast. Sure, Mega Man would like to have that robot power. Open IK really needs to find this kill. We can already see they're kind of swinging for it. Just kind of throw out a random sure you there in center stage. I think he was trying to uh, confirm light, uh, light forward air into it because that does work like at any percent. <laughs> it has to be the light hit though. Doctor light hit. So I get it. <laughs> Right. This time, though, 19 not really able to find Dill's high recovery that time. Getting the leave shield to get over 9k some space, but if you're not finding stocks, then it's... Oh, Dill's out of, Dill's out of fuel. Still out of fuel. Yep. And there it is. All right. 
from the eye, but it didn't matter yet. I can see it. Bill's hungry for a three stuck. Playing it patient though, just trying to make some space with that gyro. Doesn't really want to give up this stock. Oh, okay. No. Okay. Dill takes game two. I forgot to update the score and no one said anything. Oh, let's have a look at those. Oh no, it's still zero zero. Oh, I'm a bad streamer. Oh no. I'm sorry guys. That was a really silly way for it to go out. Over 9K was probably like, yes, she jumped onto the stage, the fool. Finally, I can ledge trap. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Yo, look at this sick, nasty ledge trapping. Oh, they'll oh. never see it they'll coming. They'll never see it coming. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> He's literally doing the shocked Pikachu face. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. All right, and looks like Over9K is actually thinking about uh, his uh, counter pick. So we'll yeah. see how it goes. Doing, doing a little bit of soul searching, you know, when you get three stock like that on the same stage that you just won on, you know. Or maybe it's Dill thinking about her bands, because I see only Final Destination has been banned so far. Mm -hmm. Perhaps it glitched and we didn't see Dill's second ban. Yep, I think that's what they... Uh, yep, okay, yeah, so she banned that. So Over9K has... Quite a few choices here. If I were him, I'd pick Kalos or Hollow Bastion. He's going with okay. Hollow Bastion. So Hollow Bastion, I guess, going to be trying to um, kind of minimize the long-range game uh, in the matchup to kind of try and maybe force some more like scrapping situations. Uh, especially like at that lemon range, like we were talking before, we saw over 9K get so much out of that in game one. Indeed. Uh, you see they're coming out. <laughs> well, a big deciding factor of game one was just that over 9K lost a stop pretty early to Rob, and Dill is very, very, very good with running away with a lead like that. Oh, absolutely. Like, if she has a comfortable lead, she will correctly, like, refuse to interact in a meaningful way. She'll let you just hang yourself. Yeah, and I mean, especially after, you know, all the gyros and lasers, it just kind of ends up being the, the death of a thousand cuts. Yeah. Like, Rob, like, for as much as we rag on Rob, his, his camping game isn't amazing, but it's enough for if you have a stock advantage. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I mean, especially with just how often Dill can throw out gyro. Never seen yeah. It. Over 9K, keeping things competitive here in this game three, we're seeing dead even percentage of weird interaction there with Rush where Dill was in hit stun. Oh, Dill read no. That, Dill read that fastball down air. That's a classic from over 9K. Oh. Read two air dodges, but didn't get the right punishes. That's a shame. Yeah, had the right idea. Unfortunately, just not able to execute on it. We're going to see if over 9K can potentially get another one of those reads and not let Dill run away with this lead. Just swinging out. I respect though. Dill went in for a down tilt grab right there. Uh, she definitely would have. Okay, game. Okay, Dill. Okay, great grab on the gyro there. Put an over 9k in the driver's seat now. Let's see if we can finally get one of these edge guards. There it is, but no hit. Yep, Dill ready for that oh, attack. The up tilt end. Oh, That's a stock. No. You, can't do, you can't show. You can't show hesitation in front of Rob like that. Not when there's a gyro at your back. Yeah, it just feels... 9K oh. just seems a little bit lost when it comes to finding this kill right now. Right, yes, yeah, still not able to find any sort of, like, stage spike situation. Swinging out with these Shoryukens, not connecting. They are safe, though, if they come off the platform like that. Mm -hmm. Wow, what a okay. weird, what an interesting sequence that was. Oh no, a bear keeping Dill safe from that Metal Blade. Yeah, you can't do that. It saves Rob from his own gyro. It's going to save him from Metal Blade. I 
Okay, just try it. Trying to keep poking with these lemons. Just, I and I do appreciate that now that we're seeing sort of like a uh, a, a slower pace coming out from Oma 9K, not trying to overextend and give Dill the huge openings that will allow her to close out the set. Trying to get a, a death of a thousand cuts mm. of his own. Ooh. No jump. Doesn't matter yet. Oh, it almost mattered though. And not an oh she really got on oh my rush. goodness over nine k did a great sequence there and wait is it stuck on okay I was like is it on her yep no it's because Rob always faces the same way no matter which way she's facing uh, Rob is facing so the crash bomber was just in the background all the time <laughs> I was like is it there is it not Roberto what are you doing mm, goes goes for Rob Zon bears all right that's a free onto the stage. And that could, have, Ooh, that could have been it. Big shield pressure coming out from 9K, but not able to close it out. Now sitting at 160. It's going to be hard. Open 9K can't even get grabbed at this point. It doesn't matter. If it's not a big robo beam, it don't matter too. Open. Oh my god. Oh, oh. Actually got hit by the crash There's no bomber. jump. There's no jump. Set himself. Still able to make it back onto center stage, though. Now living to 193. Didn't kill. They're not going to do it quite that is, yet. That is a very still snare, I got to say. Oh, that's uh, it. That's all. All of these gyros. Jesus Christ. Living forever, though. Very good. 9K was just not able to get away. It just felt like Dill had every angle covered. Every angle, there was a gyro there. It was a good set, though, to be sure. Absolutely. Boof. Over 9K kept it very competitive. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this one starting to see Over 9K like getting some momentum. <laughs> yeah, just caught Dill jumping out of shield. Right there, Over 9K could have died. <laughs> yeah, yeah, absolutely. I cannot believe Dill got onto Rush at that point. That was so goofy. Wait, is that what she did? Yeah. Oh. Yep. That, oh, that makes sense. I was like, I thought Bill, like, did up B way too fast after the air dodge. Is she, is she modding the game? <laughs> Broad directional air dodges have no cooldown. Hey. All right, and it looks like next up we're gonna be seeing uh, Vivi versus Nazara.